Hey, welcome to Blazor Bust. We've been getting some questions on YouTube about whether or not you have to activate your carbon bag before you use it. The simple answer is no, you do not. The carbon is already activated before the, even, before the bag is even manufactured. Now, to understand, to help you understand why you don't, you should look at how these, this activated carbon fabric is made, is activated in the first place. Tip, there are a couple of different ways to do it. You can do it chemically, or you can use extreme heat. Now, I use the word extreme because you know, some people are like, well, you know, my hair dryer or my clothes dryer, it gets pretty hot. Those, uh, your average hair dryer gets to around 130, 140 degrees Fahrenheit. To, to activate carbon via heat, it needs to be well over 1,000, even over 2,000 degrees. So nothing you have in your home is you know, readily available is going to do that. So rest assured, your carbon bag is already activated. You don't have to do anything. Now, if you've been using your bag for a while and scent is starting to accumulate, maybe your carbon isn't containing as, everything as well as you had hoped, you can reactivate it, reactivate it with your hair dryer. But you're not actually reactivating the carbon. You are basically burning off the odor molecules. Odor molecules are inherently unstable and heat is a good way to break them up until they're, they're nothing left. So, final time, you don't have to activate a new carbon bag the carbon is already activated.